Welcome, everyone. Welcome, again. Wait, you pressed F9, right? Yes. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I, I pressed it. I can see that. Oh, hey. It's the same button to do screenshots and to fucking see if I recorded. Yeah. Awesome. Love it when that happens. Yeah. Alright, so this is Mighty Number no. 9. We already played this, it, really. Yeah, we played it. I forgot to record. <laughs> Again. Because I'm the best at doing that. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't dash yet? Fuck, is this What, do you have to earn it? Well, I have to get to a certain point here, I think. Alright. He just, he's gonna stop to watch the news. I know, right? He's <laughs> like, what? Well, everything's on fire, but, uh... The news is on. know what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Big yeah. Brother is watching. So huh? I really don't care about the story. I'm just, no. I'm just playing the game. I mean, I don't know. So I don't know why they have try and have a story sometimes with these kinds of games. So later, when the movie adaptation happens, they have something to work off of. I guess so. I don't know. Video games don't really work well as as movies in most cases. Yeah. Well, it's because people. Sorry about that. Yeah, people like. Um... <coughs> I don't think they realize what makes the story of a video game, like, fun. Well, sometimes there's some games, I think they try and adapt the wrong games, too. But at the same time, I mean, if a game has a good story, then that's the way you're going to experience it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, there's no point in... Like... Oh, well, I don't know, like, like Warcraft worked well as a movie, but... Because there's uh, a lot of lore to that. Yeah. You know, it's the same thing that, a, like, a Dragon Age movie, or, like, an Elder Scrolls movie, or, um, Dungeons and Dragons, if they did it right, you know, this time. Yeah. Could work. What is it? Axel Recover? I don't know what that means. I see. Not gonna... Sorry about that again. I have to yell at my dog whenever she He kicked the dog to... so hard. <laughs> Is it not? Not I don't, really. I don't kick dogs. <laughs> that, that's not me, bro. Yeah. <laughs> what about cats, though? No. No. They're, they're meowing at you. Then, then just meow back. So, yeah, I don't know. Like, Warcraft works well as a movie, but... Like this one worked well as a movie. No. There's, there's like nothing to go well, off. Well, it's of like they made they made a movie out of like Super Mario Brothers, and it's like that's totally a game. You know, there's the bare bones of a story. You could make a cool movie out of something like Zelda. Yeah, probably. But if you didn't like base it on something like uh, what they would probably do is make a movie about Ocarina of Time instead of doing something like having their own original story that took place in a different era that's never been explored before, you know? Like, yeah. if they made a Zelda movie, that's what I would want to see. Yeah. Sounds pretty cool. So, I mean... There, there were talks about a Netflix series for a little while, but, yeah. uh... Nintendo denied any allegations, and I guess they're not actually going to do anything like that, so... Well, I heard that they were, um... Nintendo was talking about putting together their own, like, cinematic universe in animated movies, but I don't know. Yeah, I great. heard something about them, like, joining up with, or doing Hollywood stuff again, but, I don't know. Super Mario, like, threw them off that so hard. Yeah. Yeah, because <laughs> that game did not work well as a movie. What? Uh. Man, half of this is going to be, like, me yelling at my dog, I swear. <laughs> so, wow. anyways. Uh, last time we talked about this, what this game was exactly. So yeah, it's let's Mega Man. Again. So it's basically just Mega Man. It's made by the guy who made the original Mega Man. Wasn't that um, one in, of Inafune or something like that? Inafune. Wasn't the original Mega Man like not as well received as some of its sequels there? Yeah, I don't think so. And I think a lot of that actually had to do with its box art. Uh, yeah, yeah, because the box art was like the <laughs> blonde guy or whatever, right? <laughs> It looks so stupid. I'm gonna look it up now because it looks like a horrible Star Wars ripoff or something. Yeah. Mega Man. Here, we'll, we'll show it on screen too. Original. 
because uh, we're good at editing and stuff here, yeah. so. Here it is. Yep, right here. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so terrible. God. So, uh, so this game is a Kickstarter game. Yeah, I don't care. Whatever. Just, just, it's story. Oh, fuck. Okay. So, yeah, it's a, it was a Kickstarter game, uh, about, yeah, making, making a spiritual successor to the original Mega Man. Yeah. Okay, I don't know what's going on here. Wasn't, I don't the care. box art wasn't really good for any of them until, like, the third or fourth one. Yeah. Because even the second one has the same kind of guy on the front. <laughs> okay, I haven't tried this one yet. So. So, still ready. Go! Um. And you, you also said that okay. people aren't reacting. Yeah, people are not reacting well to this because um, this game got back for 3.8 million or something like that. I yeah, think. I think that was 3.8 or 3.2, I can't remember. Yeah, something which. like that. And, uh, okay, for the third time in a row. <laughs> so, so yeah, game got back for like 3.2 million. And, uh, this does not feel like a game with a budget of 3.2 million. No. But, it's still a good game. I mean, it only costs $15 on Steam, too. I mean, I, I feel kind of bad that some people spent $100 on this, but... I'm sure they got something else cool, though. Yeah. And plus, it's cool to say that, you know, you, you helped make it happen. Yeah. It's true of any game, really, but... So, oh, jeez. Okay. Wait, what's, what's going on here? Am I supposed to go down? Can't you, like, hold on to edges? Oh, oh okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't that was, a, that was a little bit of a, uh, a faith jump, or a, it's a, a leap, leap of faith, faith yeah. I know a lizard person. That's still a robot, even. These are all robots. Should be a lizard person. It's probably gonna be the end of this game. <laughs> everyone's message to everyone's watch out secret. The, <laughs> <laughs> the reptilians. Everyone's secretly reptilians in this game. Uh -huh. nice. ah! <laughs> it was all for naught. <laughs> it's cool. I probably would have died around the corner anyways. Bam! Good. Yes, good. Use your aggressive dash. <laughs> Use ignorance. Push LB to dash through your enemies. Strike them down. Watch this game be free on the PlayStation Network next month. Well, it'll be free somewhere at some point, probably. Yeah. It's kind of how games are nowadays. Eventually they go free for a little bit. Which is nice. Okay. So I got one. I got an extra life anyways. That guy's sleeping on the job. What a bastard. Trash can. I hate it when people sleep on the job, right, Ethan? Yeah. Like... Like I do sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> Wait, so well, Sa Dr. Sanda, the the bad guy? No. I don't, I don't know. Fucking, <laughs> I don't know who the bad guy is. Who cares? I haven't been paying attention. <laughs> but, uh, fucking destroy robots. Yeah! 
How long has it been, Ethan? Uh, oh, keeper of the time. <laughs> good question. I don't know. Probably about eight minutes. Okay. We'll go for another four. Damn you, son. Fucking things are fucking impossible to shoot. Okay. Maybe he's trying to get a job making the Mega Man sequels. If they'll ever make any. What do I. I'm gonna look that up. Why there aren't any more Mega Man games? I don't know what's going on. I'm just running. Okay. Well, there have been a couple in recent years. And they've been, like, all retro style, too. Definitely. Yeah. So, did you find anything on the ladder? Um, I don't think so. Capcom's confusion has killed Mega Man. That's the first Google. Well, there I go. Fell into into a big, 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 big giant spinny thing. What a way to go! You know who they should bring back? Bomberman. Isn't they tried to do like a gritty reboot of Bomberman, Bomberman for Xbox 360 and it was horrible. Really? Yeah. And it was funny because like it, it's so fucking serious in town. Like, and like if you see images from it, like Bomberman looks like Master Chief or something. Oh, yeah. And it's I like think Bomberman's I remember just that. a fun, like you plant a bomb, you walk away, it blows up, and then it's like, you know, solving mazes and killing enemies that way. Did you ever see that uh, MMO version of Bomberman? No. It, it was pretty cool. It's like. It was like. A, uh, well, I mean, exactly what I said. It was an MMO version of Bomberman. Yeah. Where, like, anyone could play, and you just go in and you start fighting other people. That's it? Yeah. And it's just Bomberman, but with a lot of people. That's cool. Yeah. I thought it was going to be, like, with a big epic story for a minute. No. And everybody's no, 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 just a different Bomberman. No. Bomberman. Yeah, the multiplayer version of Bomberman. Yeah. With, with a lot of people. It was cool. It was Sounds really cool. hard though, like I did I could not stay alive in that game for more than like Use the crouch dash. Hint. We but, noticed you were but standing there for four seconds. But I don't <laughs> I can't crouch. <laughs> I, I don't get it, I can't crouch. Am I supposed to do these things in order or something? Maybe. Well, we'll find out next time. Next time.